The U.S. Marine Fighting Squadron, consisting of only 27 planes, engages the bombers. In spite of heavy anti-aircraft fire, the Japanese continued their run, and at 0630 they dropped bombs along the north side of Eastern Island, and in the hangar and barracks area on Sand Island. The powerhouse on Eastern Island and the oil tanks on Sand Island were their primary targets. As the Japanese attack was ending, the first U.S. bombers from Midway, six TBFs and four B-26s, find their targets. Sixteen SPDs dive through the clouds, emerging to encounter heavy anti-aircraft fire from Hiryu. As the SPDs exit, the B-17s start their attack, going after Soryu, Hiryu, and Akagi. During this attack, Nautilus appears, putting even more pressure on the Japanese Navy. She fires off one torpedo, which misses. A few minutes later, 11 SBTU dive bombers start their attack, but were engaged by a large number of Japanese fighters, 